In the pole vault, after the vaulter leaves the ground, there's two motors. The cord of the pole, which is always pushing from the pole tip through the top hand. No matter where that is, it rotates forward as the vaulter moves forward. Going in, the vaulter uses muscle energy and sequential motion to add energy to that motor. Shoulders, hips, knee, foot. To add thrust down the line of the cord. To compress that pole more. So it shortens the lever length. Everything moves forward. And then the same, just the opposite sequential motion. From the bottom up. Then the hips drives the shoulders down the cord. The top arm's still in the cord. The top arm doesn't row out of the cord or push the pole down. The shoulders drag the pole down by thrusting mass up. That's what keeps this motor loaded. The lever length short and moving forward, which results in the body getting launched.